Welcome back to our videos. It's your boy Seth TV. Today we are in Walmart. We are in the fishing aisle of Walmart and today we are doing a challenge as you guys can see by the title. But we don't really need to be in the fishing section to get what we need for this challenge. Let's get to where we need to go. Whoa, okay, so this is what we need right here. I'm trying to see, but I think I really want to get the unflavored because that'll help a lot. That's only 55 yards, but we got a 240 yards mint, but that's mint. Is there, this one's unwaxed. Oh, mint, wait, okay. Unflavored, is there any ones that are 43, 43? Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with this one. Okay, I've never really done challenge, like my first, I'm gonna try doing a lot more challenge videos. But let's go uh, check out real quick. Hey guys, so we're on our way to check out, and um, today it's the next day, like it's the day before that I'm about to go fishing, because I went and grabbed this because I'm out grocery shopping, you know, rich gang. But um, I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna get back to you guys tomorrow at the body of water, and also we're going to fish for feet on, so that'll be awesome. Okay, so it's the next day. We're down at the spot, and I need to talk quick because my camera really keeps fogging up because that's how humid it is today but um i ran into a little trouble at the gate right there um but tips if you're trying to sneak into a place to go fishing you need a two-piece rod i just I already put it back together but you need a two-piece rod okay so you can kind of hide it and then what you also need is you need to have a plan so i looked up, i looked up the road i looked up the place and i picked one of the roads down that way where my friend where my friend lives that I'm meeting him to come fishing but I don't know his last name and I don't know his address so you say oh well this is a road up here that um that I used I said he stopped me and I was like I'm coming here to go fishing with my friend he's already at the lake and he doesn't have his phone so I can't I can't call him I know he lives on Northwest 14th Street um his house is tan but I don't I don't really know and I took it like I, I walked here or I took an Uber here so I can't really get back home so that's what you say, and he let me, and he let me buy, and that's how you deal with the security guards. But let's start the dental floss. Oh, also, it took me. It was kind of hard trying to rig this up. Well, it wasn't hard trying to rig this up. But so let's just get to fishing, and I, it's wax, so I need, I'm probably gonna dip this in the water real quick so I can get most of the wax off. So let's go. All right, team. All right. Here we go. So I got a rooster tail on here. If you guys already don't remember. Oh, that will. I filmed that like two seconds ago. So let me walk down here. Dip this in the water really quick. And then uh, let's get to fishing. Hopefully this should help. That should definitely. Yeah, that should help. Okay, let's, let's try our first cast. Oh, what the hell? Cast it over there. Okay. Let's try this. Let me get up here. Okay. Let me try. Oh my gosh, it's so slippery. All right, let's try this. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Make sure my drag is loose. Oh my gosh, it's so slippery. Oh gosh, it's already kind of like getting all milky. That's gonna be bad. Oh gosh, I can already smell the mint. It's already all over my fingers. It's actually like 12 o'clock right now. Um, I picked the hottest time of the day so these peacock will be most active because if you guys didn't already know they're from the Amazon they're not natives here in Florida but oh my gosh already got all that milky mint substance hopefully that doesn't hopefully that's just the wax coming off and it's not like the actual like uh, whatever dental floss actually like you know like um, deteriorating or something Ugh, all that wax I think it is is getting right in my face. Like it, like when I cast, like how you cast a bait caster, like a braid, when it's already wet. Like how you cast that, that's how it is. Oh, there's some peacocks over here. Let's see if we can complete the dental floss fishing channel. Oh, here's a big gar. Let's see if we can uh, start it off on a nice little speckled gar right here there's so much gar in here i love catching gar he's gonna eat this hopefully he doesn't rip it off oh he's gonna hit it he's gonna hit it oh come on come on he wants it oh yeah he has it does he have it he has it oh he's hooked oh he let go he let go he felt the hooks though so i don't know if oh he's right there 
See if we'll go after it again. No, we scared of it now. I still see him, so I might be able to catch him. Should have set the hook already. It's my bad. Right at his face. Going right at his face. Oh, he didn't even. Yeah, he got. He, he felt the hooks. Oh, here's another one. Let's see if he wants it. Complete the challenge already. Oh. Oh, he bit it. That was pretty cool. I saw him open his mouth and just hammer it. Let's see if he wants any more of it. There's a lot of gar in here. I like fishing for gar. It's really fun. Because they'll like, if you throw anything in front of their face, they'll just slam it. Come on. He's right here on the bank. Don't go under those weeds, please. Please don't. Okay, there we go. Got him. I'm going to get him. All right, reel this right by his face. Oh, it's not spinning for some reason. Oh, oh. Does he have it? Yeah, he has it. I got, oh no, what? I had him for a second. Oh, dang it. He didn't even free him fray it, so that's good. Because I guess this stuff frays pretty easy. Oh, he's going. All right, we'll probably run into a lot more guard. That's okay. We're not looking for guard. We're looking for peacocks. This actually works really good. Like, I would, I probably will keep this on my reel for a little bit longer. Oh, hey, buddy. I'm going to have to watch this guy jump off. I'm going to have to get on this real quick. So, excuse me. Can you do a little jump for me? Oh, thank you. Sorry about that. I think I'm going to actually put on top water maybe a little bit later. Yeah, I know what I'll throw. I'll throw a little popper. Oh, what was that? I don't know what's going on. I think I'm gonna have to switch up. I have a little popper I could throw. That should be that should work pretty good. Yeah, I think I might do that a little bit later on. If I can't get any bites on this because this is like the OG peacock lure. This and like spoons and stuff. Some like fast stuff that shines and moves. It's things that are shiny and they move quick. There are these. All right, let's go top water. Let's go throw the top water. And I hopefully, 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 please tell me I put scissors in here. Please, please, please. And no, you didn't. Great. Okay, so I became a little innovative, guys. So this is the little popper I'm throwing on right here. Nice, good size popper. But I had, so I had to cut the line. So this is what I did. I wrapped it around this little pole and I like, I like rubbed it right off, basically. I had the same thing for the tag end. So, uh. You know, I'm innovative. Yeah, rich gang. Oh, there's a pea right there. I see you. I see you, buddy. I see you under there. Oh, it's a good pea right there. I see you. I see you. I see you under that piling. Oh, that's a very good pea. That's actually a very good pea. Let's see if we can get him on his top water. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Where'd you go? I know there's some right, right over here. Where'd you go, baby? A good one too there's two of them all right see how it is all right so you guys don't want to be caught with dental floss okay that seemed like an honor to me you know that seems like an honor to be caught with dental floss okay let's cut this let's attempt to cut this off okay why did i ever take it off why jared why it'll fray it's tough but it's super super sensitive let me go back over here like if you just scrape it on one little thing it gets all all frayed up all frayed up what was that he went doom, doom. Ooh, great cast oh i had one on Oh gosh, there's something over there that's hungry. That didn't, that felt weird because I thought I was just hung up on one of those reeds and I saw a flash. I got one. I got one, finally. Oh, finally got one, guys. Oh, first one. Let me loosen that up. Oh, 
on the dental floss. It's not that very, not a very big one, but I'm just trying to work him. Let him get tired. He's trying to shake it. You're not gonna shake it. Yeah, he's not even that big. He's not even really pulling. Loosen that up a little bit. Come on, come on. Wait for him to get tired. First fish, finally, finally my first peacock on dental. I mean, these guys have really sharp teeth, so I brought gloves. I'm, I, yes, I am a Guggen, so if you wanna call, call me a Guggen, you can call me a Guggen. Here this guy is, got this in here for the quick thumbnail. Let me take that out of there, guy, all right. Get a quick release, get a release on this guy. Here he is, I got a glove on because he has some sharp teeth. All right, see ya, buddy, thank you. There he goes, finally. That took so long on the dental floss. There we go, awesome. Now let's get back to fishing, see if we can get another one. Still on my journey out, guys, but it is so hot. Whew. Getting pretty dark out. There's a storm, but there's a storm of brewing. There's a storm of brewing. It's so hot. Well, I'm, well, it's not that, well, it's not any hot anymore, but I'm just so tired. Ugh. Oh, big peas on a bed. Dang, I wish there were like cichlids and they wouldn't run off. See so if they come back and they see this little thing on top of it. Bed, they might come back. Well, I need to get out of here for real. Like, it's like super dark out. Oh, got one. Oh, so that's the second one, guys. It's not even bigger, uh, not smaller. It's a little guy. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, yeah, that was that same one on that bed. Yeah, that was definitely the one on that bed. Pretty guy. Dental floss, second fish. Come on, get up here. Ugh. There's a second fish, guys. Here he is, a little bit smaller. Open up that mouth. Open up that mouth. Let me get in your mouth. Let me get in that mouth. Let me get in that mouth. Gotcha. Don't shake, please don't shake. I'm just trying to help you. There we go. There's that one. There's that guy. Let me get a quick picture. See you, buddy. Ugh. Oh, there he goes. He ripped my glove a little bit. There goes that guy. He's right back on that bed, too. Got right back on that bed. So that's two on the dental floss. Two. That's that's dose on the dental floss. All right, no, he's not on that bed anymore. He already took off. But he was that one on that bed. Oh. On the dental floss. I keep forgetting this is dental floss. Like, it's so weird. Now I know the power of this. So, like, that one, I, like, flipped that fish in real quick. I didn't, Like, the other one, I was trying to play it. Because I thought, I didn't know it was going to be this tough. I didn't know it was going to be able to withstand the fish. So I was like playing with it and like, trying to tire it out. And when it tired out, I was gonna pull him up on the bank. Oh my gosh, it's, oh my gosh, that feels so nice. What is that? Guys, it's like freezing all of a sudden. That feels so good. Holy crap. Are we getting a cold front? Oh my, guys, it feels so nice right now. This breeze is like freezing me. Like it's like legit, like it's like I'm like, I'm actually cold. And it was weird, like out of the blue too. This feels so nice. I might fish a little bit longer. Cause they see they seem like a little bit more active. I guess peacock don't really like the heat that much. Thank you guys for watching so much. This is the end of this is the end of the Dental Floss fishing challenge. This was a very fun challenge. 
So it's really, really fun. There's a fish. It looks just like normal fishing line. You would never be able to tell. But I'm definitely doing a lot more challenges in the future, so stay tuned. Don't forget to subscribe. If you guys are new, subscribe. Please, please, please. There's going to be some awesome, really, really cool challenges coming up in the future. Um, the gnats are really going crazy, So, and there's a storm of brewing. It got real dark, and guys, it's not like it's late in the day at all. Let's see what time it is. It's 2.44, guys. 2.44. It's like, I don't even know what's going on, but I need to get out of here before it starts raining and the gnats are going crazy. So thank you guys for watching. This is Sef TV, and I'm out, guys. Again, please subscribe.